A new study suggests that vitamin D can help lower your blood pressure, and that's important to know because high blood pressure is a leading cause of stroke, and stroke is the third leading cause of death in this country. KPTV's Marilyn Deutsch reports on how vitamin D can lower your risk of stroke. Here in the Pacific Northwest, we joke about that golden orb that rarely appears. All kidding aside, our gray skies mean that many of us have vitamin D deficiencies and are at an increased risk for stroke. We make vitamin D after exposure to sun. Providence naturopath Cindy Reuter says our bodies produce vitamin D when we're exposed to the sun's ultraviolet rays. Others estimate that we should get 90% of our vitamin D from casual daily exposure to the sun. But when you live in Oregon and Washington, that's just not possible. There are, though, ways to compensate. The obvious way, make sure your diet's high in vitamin D. You can always buy vitamin D fortified milk and orange juice. Tofu and soy milk are also high in vitamin D, as are sardines and other fish. Also, eggs and shiitake mushrooms. Supplements are another possibility, though Dr. Reuter says you should find out what your vitamin D level is first so your doctor can tell you what dosage to take. Also, darker skinned people may need more vitamin D than others. So they need a larger amount of sun exposure to create the same kind of uh, vitamin D. Scientists now think vitamin D deficiency may cause your blood pressure to go up. Elevated blood pressure is a big risk factor for stroke. And so while our local skies tend to cast more of a gloom than a glare over us, you still need to get your vitamin D. It could just save your life. Marilyn Deutsch, Good Day, Oregon. May is American Stroke Month, and Providence Stroke Center has a special event coming up. For details, go to kptv.com and click on the Providence page.